Ricardo, you just pushed the World Cup final for the first time. How do you feel, man? Uh, good, man. Good. Uh, great. Um, we have a chance to, to play a final, to, to uh, compete for gold, you know. So that's unbelievable. It's, it's, this is what you, what you play for, what you practice for. After winning at the game tonight, Sorry? where do you feel what you guys won the game? What do you think was the key to victory? Um, we had great uh, shooting from Andy, great individual performances. We played transition, we played fast pace, um, stuck together. And I think this is, you know, the chemistry and the kind of flow that we developed throughout the tournament. So, um, Did you get nervous uh, towards the end at all? I mean, obviously, it's, it was a close game, you know. At the end, they rallied back and we, we were able to somehow, somehow snuck out the win there. For you, growing as a basketball player in the U.S., how satisfying is to, to beat the U.S. in order to get to the, to the final of the World Cup? Me, what do you mean growing? I mean, like, Heading to, to the U.S. to grow as a basketball player when you, when you attended the university. Right? Ah, um, I mean, it's you know, playing against the U.S. is always a sp special. You know, they're, they're the best players in the world. They have the most talent. Um, so, beating them on such an international stage is always huge. And do you think that being on the edge uh, against Latvia was that psychological extra push that you you guys needed? Um, no, I don't think that affected our game. But Latvia was a hell of a team as well, man. Uh, really, they, the way they, they played this tournament is unbelievable. Uh, hats off to them. This was a really tough game. We played previously. Um, and we were able to win that, and now we're able to win this against the U.S. as well.